We're in the kitchen today and I'm gonna show you how to make bologna salad. So back in the old days, they didn't have ham that they could just shred up to make like sandwich spread or bologna spread or a ham salad. So um, they used bologna because bologna is relatively, even today, much cheaper than uh, ham. So they chopped it up and made it into a salad. So I'm gonna show you how easy that is to do today. Now, my favorite, my favorite kitchen appliance is my little ninja here. So I'm not gonna work hard. I'm gonna put this in the ninja and I'm gonna grind it all up. When we come back, it's gonna be ground up. I'm using one pound of bologna, Oscar Mayer. I would sing for you, but y'all would be like, oh, stop it, woman. So I did this in batches. So this is my last batch and I cut my bologna up small like that and just separated it when I put it in there, okay? And then it called for um, two tablespoons of onion. However, we really like onion, so I just put a half of a small onion in there. And you all know we like jalapeno. So I put a jalapeno in there and, uh, and I'll grind this up. And when you're grinding up your bologna, if you add like the little piece of the onion or, it, it, and if you add jalapeno, you don't have to add jalapeno. It helps that stay where it grinds it all up and doesn't get stuck, okay? So we have our one pound of bologna, half of an onion, and then I added a jalapeno in our bowl. And you can see it's ground, it's ground finely. And so now they call for sweet relish. Uh-oh. There we go. My hands were slippery from touching that bologna. So sweet relish. One tablespoon of sweet relish. Just hump it up and dump it in there like that, okay? That works just fine. And then they call for one tablespoon of mustard. If you do the relish first and then put the mustard in there, little trick I'll show you if you don't know it. And you go to do the mustard, look, it comes out almost completely clean really cool so I don't have to scrape it and then we're gonna put three-fourths cup mayonnaise three-fourths cup mayonnaise but how I do it is I eyeball it and so I pretty much know that's probably a fourth there's another fourth and there's another fourth now I'm gonna leave that sit there in case it takes more than that Oh, and we need to just salt and pepper to your liking. And let me show you a trick in case you don't know this. I didn't learn this until a year ago, and, and I'm I'm up there in age, and I didn't learn it until a year ago. You ever notice on the bottom of your salt and pepper shakers, there's a ridge. I always wondered what that ridge was for. Watch this. And that's, that pepper just comes out just, oh my gosh, so nicely. Now, I can't do it on the salt because salt comes out too fast as it is. <laughs> but that is a really cool really cool thing we learned we were tickled with that when we learned that we use it all the time now very fun and then just mix it up really really well so I know for me I want just a little bit more mayonnaise in there and that's okay if that's what you like you do it you do what you like you're eating it and so this is gonna make a real inexpensive sandwich spread I mean that bologna I don't remember what it cost but the pound of bologna, it couldn't have been more than $4. I really don't know because I don't buy it that often. I make this every once in a while and my husband just loves this. Um, at home, when I was being raised, we had this all the time because it was inexpensive. We were out playing, we could come in, we could get a sandwich, go back out playing and it didn't cost a lot. And we had a lot of neighbor kids in our house, so it, it didn't go far, but it was inexpensive. And so this is exactly how I like mine to look. You take a slice of bread, or you can use crackers. Um, I haven't had breakfast, so this is my early lunch. And then you put it on there, and you've got yourself an inexpensive sandwich. Enjoy. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I love it. I need to make it more often. Subscribe and like and pass it on. All right, bye-bye.